Hello, this is Kim from Cabline, and today we're looking at a tip and trick to view and access old versions of files using Vault's web client. Okay, so um, via the web client here, we can log into our Vault. And remember too that uh, this is available through Vault Professional, and uh, this doesn't use a license. It uses multiple users so they can access your data via your company's intranet. So I'm going to log in and we've got our uh, folder structure here on the left and we can see um, I've got a workspace folder. If we go down to the workspace you can see here too that I've also got a specifications folder and in that specifications folder I've got a number of different file formats. Um, that include PDFs and uh, this one here at the top I'm interested in in DOCX. Now you can see that um, I've currently got uh, a lifecycle added to this. Um, we can see this is a, an office document, it's at revision one and you can see that it's actually version three at the moment and uh, if I access that file and uh, we view the general data on that file um, we can see that uh, indeed uh, this is at version 3 and of course if I click on the file I'm offered to open or save the file if I just open the file this will open the uh, document in uh, Word and uh, we can see uh, the new Cadline logo here with some text in here and I'm just going to close this off so um, Vault Client's really doing its job in providing me with the latest data but what if I wanted to perhaps find something that was an older version? Perhaps I wanted to modify an older version. Well, here I can use an advanced search. And I'm going to put, add a couple of criteria in here. First one, I'm going to specify uh, the file extension. So uh, there's some conditions that I can select. I'm going to be specific. Is DOCX. I'll add that one to it. And also I'll add another criteria which is version and the condition for this is greater than, it actually says it's um, greater than zero. If I add this one in and then do my search here, it will find all the files with a DOCX extension, DOCX extension and uh, you can see at the top of this here it's uh, found three versions, all the versions of uh, that particular file. So if I click on uh, the top line here, version one, uh, indeed that verifies that is version one of that file. And if I click on the file and we just open the file here, you'll see that this is much older version of this, this is the original version of the file. So um, just looking at a couple of settings that you might to be aware of here too that might help is if I go to the configure tab. Now the configure tab, remember, is available through uh, the administration rights. You need administration rights to go and access this to set this up. And uh, you can see at the bottom here that I, at the moment I've just got this restricted to look at files. And uh, again, I'm not opting to show just only the released revisions. And you can see too in my main listing for files here, so uh, if we just look at the details here obviously, where I've, I've included the thumbnail and uh, obviously the revision and version of the files is the version that we need to uh, uh, look at. So uh, when you do view that, obviously if we go back to our files list uh, and we look uh, at that general area, just go back to where we started on here, here you can see uh, that sort of configuration, but by using the advanced search, you'll be able to find earlier versions of the file and perhaps access those uh, for any edits or modifications that you need to do. Thank you very much.